Jangan nak make it I'm a champion Champion, champion So I think it has contributed immensely to the growth of the industry Because in life, what gets rewarded gets done Head is creates good competition, healthy competition Which is needed in the music industry It's become a platform that celebrates excellence is a platform that rewards artists for the good work they've done over time. The head is already doing practically everything like it should be done. For over a decade, the head has been instrumental in giving Nigerians the best that the music industry has to offer in terms of musical artistry, fashion statements, and even pop culture narratives. I like the fact that the head has helped to showcase most of the brilliant Nigerian musical talents the world has seen. And I believe that the Headis itself has touched on one key passion point in Nigeria, which is music, and showcasing what Nigerians have done, breaking grounds in Africa and breaking grounds across the world. I don't think pop culture will be where it is now without the Headis, because it's all about recognition. And the Headis have been going now for about 12, 13 years. So when you, you know, to celebrate the culture, consistency is key. An award ceremony like Headis definitely, you know, is a platform that celebrates that. Go, baby, my party. Definitely our music has gone global. If your music has gone global, then it stands to reason that our awards too must go global. Taking it to Atlanta for me, I think will introduce the awards to the diaspora. After 14 years, she'll be, you know, looking at the next level. And the next level from being a national event to being a continental event. Obviously, we'll be to be looking at the global space. Going international is the next stage. It's a welcome development. It's going to help the pop culture get more exposure, get more recognition as well. And also get Americans who have taken a keen interest in Afrobeats, in, in the sound, allows them to watch and also be a part of, of the immersive experience up close and personal, as well as interact with the artists, you know, stakeholders, who are pushing the sound beyond our borders. I strongly believe that the head is going global for this edition is something that has been long overdue. You know, when a product is good, you circulate it around the world. And uh, that's what's happening now. Definitely, definitely, I think it's a great thing. So for the head east to land in North America and Atlanta, which is one of the black capitals of America, where there are a lot of Nigerians in the diaspora, it's a very powerful moment. I hope to be there myself. If you can be there, make sure you're an ATL. 15th edition, Atlanta, America. Very welcome idea. Here we come to show the world what we have been doing in the last two decades without their even noticing. Without a doubt, what the Eddies is doing this year is definitely going to push, further push Nigerian uh, music into a world space or a global space, no doubt. I mean, so we're taking it to every nook and corner, you know, so yeah. And, and I think that as long as the Eddies can place itself as the holy grail or amongst the holy grail of awards then um, it will continue to kind of be pivotal to the growth of the scene the music scene in nigeria it's continuity is what is needed they've been the longest so far the ones who've been consistent so just continue really continue to be to anchor everything on excellence and also continue to create platforms for nigerians to showcase the talent we have in this part of the world Hey, what's up, people? This is Cool DJ Jimmy Jats. My name is Bovi. Hey, yo, my name is Jude Okoye. Well, guys, Ian Kadebayo is the name. 15 Eddies is here upon us. The head is happening live in Atlanta, 15th edition, 2022. This is the 15th Eddies. Let's make it happen. See you guys there. See you there. You should be there. The Headies.